All right, I have something kind of cool to share, and it may prompt some of you older folks like myself to do something similar or give you an idea about something. So uh, when I was younger, I always would see in my parents' closet in the very top shelf a bunch of these. And these are Super 8 movie reel. This one here says 1966 Christmas. I don't know if you can see that or not. Maybe, maybe not. But I've got a whole box of them here. And um, these were, were film that my dad made. And uh, I know that now because I've, I've gone through them all. So you get an idea about the box. There's a box of it, right? So I've got, oh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, about 15 different Super 8 tapes. And if you open one up, if you've never seen these, some of you have seen these, but if you open one up, it looks... I'm not going to get it out, but that's what it is. Real to real tape, okay? So I saw these and I thought, man, I wonder what's on those. You know, a long, long time ago. And I finally took it upon myself about 25 years ago, actually, to get these and then get a, um, a projector to be able to play them. I didn't have one. I can't remember where I got it. I may have... I may have checked it out from the Davis County Public Library. Um, but uh, it looks kind of, I'm going to show you right here. I'm going to put a picture up there. It looks like one of those. Okay. And so what I did is I uh, fixed it up reel to reel, and I played them on a screen. I had a, a, a screen, a projector screen, right, in a dark room. I played them live. And then I recorded them onto this. This is this has been about 20 years ago, so this is an older. Uh, I'm not even sure what this is called, but it uses, um, you know, it uses something like that. Okay, and I recorded that live down onto. A bunch of these small mini DV cassettes, something like this. Um, there was also some, some I think Super 8 cassettes that look similar to this that fit into here. So I recorded it and then I uh, dubbed them down from, th from those cassettes, I plugged it into the back of a VHS, VCR recorder, and I dubbed them down to VHS. And I gave these to my family as a gift in the year 2000. Well, once the technology has gotten better over the last 22 years, I've really wanted to digitize all of that to preserve it, you know, forever. One thing I'll show you in this box of uh, Super 8 tape that I have, there's some loose tape. And, um, you know, this is what happens to that stuff over time. It deteriorates, it falls apart, and so this is not salvageable. I don't even know what's on this. It could probably be taped together and played, but I, you know, for all intents and purposes, it's not, you can't use that anymore. So when you, once it's digital, you preserve the quality that you have, and it doesn't degrade from there, right? We know that. And so uh, I've gone back through all of these, you know, really over the last 25 years or so. And I've got video from my, that my father shot. It's kind of cool. His handwriting is on all this stuff. My father passed away about 18 years ago. And uh, I've got video from a, as early as 1966 up through the early 1970s. And so what I've done is, now those have already been put on VHS. Okay, and again... I want to just make sure you get an idea of this. I know I've shown it several times, but this box of reel-to-reel, of -reel, right? Anyway, so I'd already put those on these VHS. And so what I've been doing, finally sat down and had time to do this, is 
uh, I have been, I, I drummed up some very old VCRs, very old, and some of them weren't, weren't working very well. And if you look, they are right there. And so I've got two VCRs, only one is working. And then with some uh, personal family videos years ago, I put those on VHS and dubbed them down to DVD. That's a DVD writer, recorder. You can't see it all that well. I can't, I can't stretch this all the way over. Let me see if I can get a little bit closer. Yeah, I can get a little bit closer. Make see a little bit better. So this is a, a DVD, DVD recorder. So what I've done now is I've taken this VCR and I ran it through this TV, which is an older flat screen, but it's got RCA inputs on the back and on the side, which is important for this case. So I've run this VCR into the TV and then the TV out to this DVR and I've been playing these VHS tapes. And I'll show you. You might get a kick out of this. I'll pause it real quick. But this is the one I have in there right now that I'm in the process of dubbing down. I came across this. This is a speech that I did back in 1990 when I was 18, 19 years old. Can't see it right now because I paused it, but that might not ever see the light of day. <laughs> but anyway, so I'm dubbing those down onto here. And then I take the DVDs that you can see right there and I'm running them through VLC software. That's the only laptop I have that has a DVD player on it. So the DVDs are being played through there and VLC is, I've got one going right now, you can't, probably can't see it, but it's ripping that video off the DVD into a digital file. And then I'm plugging in this, you know, just a standard, standard, external hard drive and plugging them into this computer because it's a little bit faster. It's my work computer and uploading them into my Google Drive account and they're digitized. So that has been and it continues to be a very cool process and uh, yeah if you have any questions, put them in the comments about how to do this. Got lucky, I pieced together several pieces of equipment I've had laying around for years. And putting it all digital. And this video is gonna be preserved as well. It's gonna be digital. So uh, for a future family that might be watching this, hope you enjoy.